The Integrated Planning Initiative marks a new way of doing things at the Port of San Diego. It all starts with our guiding document, the Port Master Plan. This plan was drafted in 1981. Since then, it has been amended 35 times to accommodate specific projects. The Port is shifting our planning process to be more strategic and comprehensive, less driven by individual development projects. The first phase of this multi-year master plan update process will define a new vision and guiding principles for the Port with input from the public and our key stakeholders. Integrated planning will be modeled in part on the success of the Chula Vista Bayfront Plan, a process that was inclusive, scientifically sound, and rooted in community involvement. After a decade-long joint planning process between the Port of San Diego and the City of Chula Vista, the California Coastal Commission unanimously approved the 535-acre Chula Vista Bayfront Plan, the largest available coastal development opportunity in Southern California. The process was driven by extensive public engagement and compromise and should be used as a model for future projects. It resulted in a realistic plan supported by a coalition of stakeholders, many of whom are here today. The project's most dramatic milestone event took place on February 2, 2013. At sunrise, with tens of thousands of people watching from around the bay, we knocked down the big, hulking power plant that had sat on the waterfront for more than 50 years. Since then, the site has been scraped clean and more than 21,000 tons of material have been recycled. Eventually, the footprint will become a green public park and an RV park. This dramatic event was more than just a demolition project. It was a visible sign that Chula Vista's industrial past is making way for a future of better public access to the waterfront. Now we have a shovel-ready plan in place for Chula Vista's prime waterfront property. The plan is moving forward with a focus on guidelines for future hotels, a conference center, and other projects for our member city. In April 2013, stunning new concept renderings were unveiled to show what the Chula Vista Bayfront could look like. The port also convened a Bayfront Cultural and Design Committee to shape design guidelines for what could eventually be built. In November 2013, the port kicked off its extension of H Street westward. The $7.2 million Bayfront Access Project will help attract the quality investment that we all envision for Chula Vista. You know, probably for the first time in 60 years, H Street will open from the hills to the beach. Doesn't that sound good, doesn't it? The Chula Vista Bayfront Plan includes a seamless mix of hotels, restaurants, commercial and residential uses that will provide a huge economic impact for the South Bay region and will be a significant revenue generator for the port for the next 50 years. The plan, when built out, would provide 2,200 permanent jobs. The Chula Vista Bayfront will also provide more than 230 acres of open space by creating parks, habitat, and open space areas and a green belt that spans the South Bay. With strong public support, the Bayfront Master Plan continues to move forward. It serves as a model of community-based planning as we move forward with integrated planning for the entire port.